We are live, just so you know, on Flagpole Productions there now, my friend. How cool. Now, I wonder how you could do it and I can't. I don't know, but I will tell you that at any moment my laptop could start smoldering and blow up. So, Now, that's one thing we don't want, that's for sure. You know, the reason Steve did this is because last week, I don't know what happened, but my computer took a dump. And when that happens, I start screaming. McGuire, McGuire, and uh, you know, and he got a hold of me. I actually got a hold of him, and then he got a hold of me back. Uh, so we've been going back and forth a little bit here. Yeah. And he's trying to help me straighten this thing out. So Steve can get on my show, but I can't. What's well, going on? it's it's entirely possible that Facebook has developed taste. <laughs> <laughs> then I'm screwed. <laughs> So, yeah, you must have stayed up all night to think of that. Uh, yeah, it doesn't take me that long to think up things like that. Yeah, yeah, sure. So, especially when it comes to me. Oh, we got uh, Jeff Thompson saying, "Who are these two noobs?" <laughs> you know, Jeff. It's funny you came on. I was just talking about uh, how the Booty Boys sent me the maple syrup down here, and you guys sent me that other stuff. And I was just telling them how much I absolutely love the maple syrup. I got a little bit left. Uh, because right. uh, I started with, I was sharing it with my wife, and then I put the kibosh on that. And <laughs> I used this, and she went back to the log cabin. So it's lasting a little bit longer now. Yeah. Although she's not as friendly. But <laughs> <laughs> Well, maple syrup, like, I don't know if you know this, but I literally used to make my own maple syrup, like, from scratch up at the cottage. Our neighbors used to do it all the time. So we'd travel up on March break. And we tap all the trees in our cottage's um, front yard and backyard, for that matter. I'm not going to ask you how you tap the trees. You drill a hole. And you I know a... how you do it. <laughs> <laughs> all right. <laughs> Anywho. Yeah. Oh, we got somebody that says, hi, Steve and Fred Schultz. Whoever it is, hello. And, uh, <laughs> you know, we always appreciate you guys watching. It's... Uh, I got to tell you, you know, without you guys, all we are is just a couple of heads on here talking, but we absolutely love anybody that tunes in. And to me, you know, that always means not just a lot to me, but it means a lot, you know, when I think about paintball, because people have enough foresight that, that when we jump on, that you tune in and actually help support us, which that's what we're doing is supporting paintball. So, you know, it just kind of all keeps rolling along that way. We absolutely love it. Period. absolutely i'm just going to create a quick banner here so everybody knows what's going on nothing's going on that's what i mean yeah i've been working today i got my work clothes on i'm just sitting here all fat dumb and happy just knocked down a couple of slim gyms uh drinking my fruit juice uh, hey. <laughs> that's what's happening brother yeah well all right so on the plus side is you're not completely banned from facebook because <laughs> you're because we're still live I know. I just, what I can't do is I can, can't connect it to my site. What had happened was I connected it, Steve, to the WCPL site. Yeah. And uh, then when it wasn't working, I got back on and I unconnected it. Well, obviously, I don't know what happened. All my, my whole site went all French. Everything was in French. So I couldn't say, even see what was going on. So that took a few days to get that straightened out, to get it back into English right now. Right. So now I'm working on... Uh, on the rest of it here. Well, I don't know what well, you're went working on. on it. I'm just sitting here looking important. I went into your I went into the admin book and yep. I can take a look at everything that's been done by administrators. And I haven't seen anywhere where somebody changes the settings from English to French. So well, I'm not I can, 100... I, I can tell you everything was French. Oh, I believe you. You know, the only thing that wasn't French was like uh, when I post something or the comments on my show, those weren't French. But everything around it, everything that had to do with Facebook, you know, um, right? Yeah, that was all in French, every bit of it. So, you know, I mean, I tried learning French, but, you know, it's been six days and that was unsuccessful. So, yeah. uh, thank God I got it back to English. Yeah, the only thing you really need to worry about as far as French goes is French kissing. And that comes from a guy that lives in a country where French is one of the two official languages. It's yeah, that's, useless. that's what I hear. That's what I hear. So, but I don't speak a I don't speak a lick of it. Oh, I cool. honestly can't even say the alphabet in French. I I, I can't. 
I don't think I was supposed English, to be either. taught. <laughs> I was supposed to be taught that in sixth grade. Yeah. Well, you so. went that far, huh? Oh, well, I was supposed to be taught that. Well, see. No, I meant you went that far in school. Oh yeah, I went. I went all the way into college. Believe right. it or not. And why can't you fix my computer? I not there. <laughs> You're talking about a guy that dropped out in the second grade. Now, come on. I'm not there. If I was there, I could do a little bit of. I'm sure you could, but you have fixed things, uh, shall we say, from up there for me before. Yes. Yes. Yep. Absolutely. So, um, so all anyhow. Right. All I can think is, at this point, what we might need to do is, and <laughs> sorry we're boring everybody out there. <laughs> Welcome to Fred and our lives when you don't see us live on shows. <laughs> Absolutely. And, so and welcome you know, to... this is the first time I've been unshaven. Me too. Yeah, yeah, I, I can <laughs> tell. It's been a couple of days, huh? Skunk stripes. <laughs> um, yeah, this is what Fred and I are like. The, now you're now looking at the wizard behind the curtain. <laughs> Just so you know, this is <laughs> that's correct, Mundo. These are not the droids you're looking for. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, all I can think of is that whenever the things got severed, maybe what we need to do, or what you need to do, and I can't do it for you, is you might need to uninstall StreamYard and then reinstall it so that it gets a solid connection. I thought that's what we just got done doing though. Didn't we just do that? No. And then what we did was we went into Facebook and we allowed Facebook to have uh, StreamYard as an app on the group so that StreamYard can access it. But we haven't at addressed StreamYard side of things. Man, I don't know if I want to click, you know, get off StreamYard because then I... <laughs> I'm having a hard time getting them connected. If I get off that and then I can't get it back going again, then I'm really screwed. Fred, you know, I can get Connor's on both being of them. rude again. Ozzy kissed like a French. <laughs> What's going on, Connor? I don't think he's being rude. He's being truthful. But anyhow. Yeah. <laughs> and somebody says, we like the scruffy look. Oh, I don't know that who right? that is, but. And somebody's saying, hey, guys, hey, back. So. What's going on, everybody? You know, uh, this is funny. This is just supposed to be a test, but it's yeah. turned into a, a little bit of a show here. And, See, uh, and this is why I do cool. it. This is why I tend to run all my tests live and I include everybody in what I'm doing. It just, it's just a connection. Oh, and but, I thought uh, it was you only did it when you were sober, so it was every few weeks. Oh, it was apparently it was Bond Chick. So, and hey, so hey, Maureen, I know got, your name now. <laughs> I have got, I have got to meet, I've got to meet that girl. Yeah, me too. Hey, she's on all the time. I got to yep. tell you, it's the coolest. And I believe and I she's from either. Tennessee, which means. That's what I heard. Yeah. So, I mean, Bond fan. Yay. I'm pretty sure she's blonde. Double yay. She's a paintball. Triple yay. And she's in Tennessee, which means biscuits and freaking gravy. I'm, I may very well be married yet at this point, and we don't even know it <laughs> yet. So I love it. I love it. Yeah, I definitely want to meet her. You know, I, I, don't, I don't even know what she looks like at all. Oh, well, you have to go and on our web page, and, and there's pictures. I might have to try that. You know, uh, everybody goes, oh, I know her. I know her. And I go, yep. yeah, what's she like? And I go, well, I'm not really sure. I never met her. Well, how the hell do you know her then? You know, I guess guess like I know you, Steve, you know, on, yeah, yeah. on well, the screen. As far, hey, all I'm saying is, we need to fan, put on the show blonde, sometimes. The paintball ticket. player, Southern. Yeah. Bam! I, I, I know, biscuits <laughs> and gravy. Like it just well, it's not just biscuits and gravy. Like I mean, yes, but there's like fried chicken, and then there's pig roast, and there's gun laws that I love, and just just football, and just I got yes. it. I, I, I got it. I got it. You're working yourself into an eating frenzy. Be careful. Yeah. So, and anyway. Yeah. All right, so we should probably cut this show down before things go completely left. Everybody, this is just a test show. We just wanted to make sure that we could broadcast on Flagpole Productions because both Fred and I are having technical difficulties. My laptop is ready to start smoldering at any given moment. I have a backup. I just haven't set it up yet. I just got it today. Fred is no longer in the the realm of French on his computer. Now we just got to get him hooked up, and we will have both shows Flagpole Productions, Mr. Fred and Friends, and what the hell is my show again? Popular Unknown. That's it. Yeah. We'll get them all up this week. That's right. And Bond Chick, we love you. We I, I do. 
Yeah, I think do. I we love her. I think I love you a little more than Fred does, though. No, I don't think so. I don't think so. You know, Canadian love and American love is like two different deals, baby. Just remember yeah. that this yeah. is all live and recorded, and you have a wife. Just saying. That doesn't mean I can't love her. That doesn't mean I can't want to meet her. <laughs> Fair I enough. I didn't say I wanted to go have biscuits and gravy with her. I just wanted to say hi. <laughs> yeah, no. So that's <laughs> anyway. All right, this is going south fast. <laughs> Look and at I that. Mean I got that people actually liking you. Literally. I got people actually liking you. That's pretty cool. Yep. You need to have me on more often, man. Yeah. Uh, somebody says, uh, come to Jurassic in Orlando in March next year, please. And thank you. Hashtag Bonchick. Oh, very cool. What is you know, Jurassic actually, in actually, Orlando in March? The WCPL. Um, there's going to be one in uh, Orlando. I believe it's... Uh, I don't know. I got to look at the schedule, but it's the second one out. I have the first WCPL and the second one is going to be uh, Rick Rico Fernandez and it's going to be down there. So uh, it's going to be in the early part of the year, I guess. Yeah, But uh, when is it in March? When is, when is, when is this Jurassic thing in March and where is it and what, what's going on? Cause my be birthday cool, actually. is March 15th. So if people want to start sending donations to fly me to Orlando to play at Jurassic, whatever that means, I can, I can be Nikki Cuba and just T Rex. Well, yeah, well, you know what? We we need to check on that and see exactly what that is. Yeah. Yeah, because now you know now it's piqued my interest. Right. Yeah, absolutely. So I'm, I'm not saying flying no. to, I'm flying to St. Louis. Uh, what? Not next week, but the week after. There's a seven man tournament that I'm flying there for. So. I'm just upset I'm missing World Cup this this year, but it is. You know what? what? I was going to go down there, but I I just decided not to. Nothing against World Cup. Nothing. Against oh no, it's Tommy fantastic. Or anything like that. It's just uh, I've got so much stuff going on out here, and I've got so many other trips planned. And Tommy gave me a free spot to go down there, but I just uh, I just can't get away right now. I just got. What do you mean by a free on. spot? Like a place for a booth? Yep, he gave me a free booth. He he told me if I come down here, he'd give me a free booth and ask me if I'd come down and televise live. And uh, I was going to do it, but uh, I I've got a trip not this week, but next week to St. Louis. And, and you don't have I, me with when you. When I come back from St. Louis, I got the one down in L.A. So I'm just uh, just too jammed up. I don't want to be gone every week for the next four weeks. That's that's like the old paintball Fred back in the day. And so March seventeenth is St. Patrick's Day. And it's that's her birthday, huh? How I don't know. cool is that? Yep. Maybe. March 17th. So it's gonna be like a birthday party and a big game or something, maybe? I don't know when Jurassic is. I don't know anything about it, except for what just came up in the quotes. Ah, uh it. Jurassic re reanimation, March 26th and 27th in Orlando, cool. Florida. But I don't know what field that is. But no, we'll find out. Sure. Yeah. yeah, that'd be cool, huh? I want to shoot people. Yeah, <laughs> I always want to shoot do. people. <laughs> <laughs> and yes, we're talking about baseball. Mostly. Absolutely. Mostly. Absolutely. Yeah, presume we'll both be off Facebook. <laughs> Still so. not knowing what the hell happened, huh? All right. Well, this has been a successful 13 and a half minute test. I think we should probably shut this down. Everybody, thanks for joining our test. And uh, we're going to see you all in a few days. Yeah, absolutely. Be safe. Play with passion. Play hard, play safe, play fair. Or go play paintball. <laughs>